everybody I'm back I wanted to actually do a video that was requested in my um, products I regret video I mentioned in the sidebar that there were other products that I did regret buying but I had actually already returned them as well so I was asked to specify which of those products drugstore products had um, I not been able to include in the video because of that. So I'm going to talk about that right now. Hopefully this video will be relatively short. There's a few things and obviously since I've returned them already I don't have them to show you but um, there's a few things that I have returned because I just haven't liked them. Uh, the first thing that comes to mind is the Rimmel Sexy Curves Mascara. I know that there's a lot of people that really uh, like that mascara here on YouTube. It honestly just didn't do it for me. It got really clumpy and um, I, I didn't like it. I like a really natural lash look just because my, my lashes already kind of do enough on their own and I have a really bad habit of picking out my eyelashes. Uh, <laughs> I. I know it sounds weird, but I pick up my lashes, and um, I have really sensitive eyes, so I'm pretty picky about my mascaras, because I have a tendency to just end up picking it off. <laughs> so I try not to wear mascara usually. Like, on an everyday basis, I do not wear mascara, just because it annoys me. So, Rimmel Sexy Curves Mascara didn't work out for me, and the wand just really didn't work out for me. And uh, another item would be, and I mentioned this in a video I just uploaded, is the L'Oreal Decrease Primer. That also definitely did not work out for me. I ended up getting it on a buy one, get one free. When they had uh, different L'Oreal products on sale at the drugstore. And I didn't even bother keeping it because it just was so bad. It didn't work for me, and I, if it works for you, that's fantastic. To be honest with you, I'm jealous if it works for you because it's a very affordable primer, and it just didn't work for me. Another drugstore item that I've returned would be um, the Maybelline Dream Matte Mousse, the one that comes in a jar, that foundation. And I've returned that because, to be honest with you, it's extremely difficult for me to find a drugstore mask. Um, drugstore foundation, sorry, that works for my skin tone as well as my skin texture and type. And um, the color selection just really didn't end up working out for me. Uh, either something was definitely too reddish and uh, deep or it was just um, too beige or pink. I have not tried the liquid mousse. I've heard those colors are a little bit better for yellow undertone skins, which is what I have. I haven't tried that yet, and um, hopefully I will soon or sometime, whenever. Um, another drugstore item that I have returned is uh, the Rimmel Underground Lip Glosses, and they're the ones that have the, they say like, spark it up on the tube and they look really glittery and that's exactly what they are and that's how it ends up looking on your lips extremely glittery and I don't go for that look I really don't think it looks good on me and I just don't like that look of just a lot of glitter so I have a tendency to steer away, steer away from it so that's something I've returned and uh, I've also returned some I'm sorry I, I had a list in front of me and now I'm blanking out. Oh, uh, there's a CoverGirl's Exact Lights um, eyeliner. Sorry, it's not called Exact Lights. It's just a CoverGirl liner. It's a dual pack. And it's this brow and eyeliner pencil. And I got it in black. And I returned that because uh, even <laughs> I do a lot of water lining and tight lining and stuff. And it really did not work for me. It didn't even come on. The color didn't even come on to my waterline. So... I did not like that. I returned that. And I'm trying to think. There's there's a few other products that I have returned. Um, honestly, it's been a really long time since I've returned them, though. So I'm not even sure that they make some of those products anymore. But 
yeah, hopefully this video helped a little bit. And um, thank you so much for watching. And let me know whatever else you would like me to do another video on. All right. Have a nice weekend. Thanks, guys.